must have read what Shakespeare said back in a distant age. All the world's a stage and the men and women in it merely play. You are the actors in this fast-moving drama. You are the factors in the world's panorama. The world's a stage and life's a play. So you must be certain at the rise of the curtain whether you'll stand in the balcony with your cigarette butts or sit in the orchestra with Dizzy and Saul Peanut. In times of trial, what brings us the greatest comfort? An acquittal. Well, I'm not on trial, so what for you quitting there, kitten? I thought you had enough salt peanuts. No, man, I never get enough peanuts. You know, back home where I come from, they call me Peanut Head Jackson. Why is that? Is your head too soft? No. Too light? No. Too long? No, nah, too thick. I thought you were coming home for dinner. Um, I was trying to get Dizzy here to uh, let you chirp, you know. Uh, he wanted your social security number and... You're dependent? Ain't got any. Well, are you married? Yeah, but he ain't dependable. Okay, what'll it be? Just hit a note. Okay, fellas, hit it. Oh, well, oh, well, I feel so fine today. 
over there. question on you. Shoot. How long was Cain mad with his brother? As long as he was able. You dig me, Jack. You dig me. You better dig this next number. Oh, take it. I ain't mad at you. Man, that was really on. Now, be a nice fella and run down a few scales for Johnny and Henny. Okay. Oh, take it.
old man. Uh, I don't like to take advantage of a solid cat like you, but uh, have you got another little number for me? Shut sure up. Don't feel that way. I know I kind of worked you a little hard tonight. I said, sure enough. Well, what do you mean, sure enough? It's the name of the song, sure enough. Sure enough? Sure enough. that little number while I waited for you. You waited for me? I waited for you. All right, somebody waited for somebody.
but I waited for you. Now you can wait for me. Major seventh with the flatted fifth and the erupted sixty ninth over the. Uh... Pardon me, but is this the Elysian Field? Uh, solid home, the Elysian Fields, local 802. Uh, my name is Bach. Uh, if you haven't heard of me, well, that's your fault. I'm the chief of musicians here. Not the Bach, the Johann Sebastian Bach. Gee, I've lived for this moment. You mean you have died for this moment? Well, I brought some friends of mine from down the earth there, and St. Peter told me to present my credentials to you. Mm-hmm. Uh, yes, so let me see them. Mm-hmm. Oh, yes, you're the young composer, John Burke Dizzy Gillespie. We were expecting you. The other Hepcats have already arrived. Hepcat? Yeah, my colleagues. There they are. I'm Gilbert. Please, Captain. I'm Sullivan. I'm Gilbert. I'm Sullivan. I'm Gilbert. I'm Sullivan. I'm Sullivan. I'm Gilbert. Oh, man, you crazy. Clever's always composing. But do they do they play too? And how? Open up them pearly gates, Cat, and take it. <laughs> been poring over maps and other books. I've searched the world in all its old forgotten nooks, looking for that one and only little paradise, that wonderful but so elusive spot, a place where man's foot is never set. And for all my looking, this is what I get.
the lady that put a bop in rebop, Miss Helen Humes, is crazy about a man. They call it a bow fiddle, a dog house, too. After this bass hit, see what you can do.
Fage in this dance as groovy as can be. We'll really rock this joint with Boogie in C. me weak. Give me a little tune to uh, pep me up. How about shooting you a little dynamo eh? Well, all right, blast away. Ow!
Labyrinthology. What it means? My apology. I bet that boy could dance on water. Yeah, Blocks Bellion can dance off juice. Man, he is mad. Yeah, but he beat when he should have bopped like this. How? Jump right up on the stand, but he couldn't seem to dig the band. He thought he was the cream of a crop, but he beat, or when he should have bopped. All cats gathered around to see what he was trying to prove. But anyone could plainly see that he was dragging them out of the groove. At last, the leader turned around and said, Listen, Pops, you had better stop, or there you go, you did it again. You just beat, or when you should have bought.
gathered around to see what he was trying to prove. But and it was to plainly see that it was dragging them out of the groove. At last the leader turned around and said, Listen, Pops, you had better stop. Oh, there you go, you did it again. You just beat, or oh, when you should have bopped. Uh, have you heard of uh, Grubner Square? Yeah, we got a number by that name, Grubner Square. Well, man, let me tighten your wig. I'm going to show you what I found in Grubner Square. Mr. Gillespie. Mr. Carter. Uh, now, if you and your cats can put down something hard like that, we might admit you to the Heavenly Society of Musicians and Composers. Hold tight, Bucky, old boy. You ain't heard nothing yet.
And now I give you Mr. Ralph Brown, the cat that puts those ground pads down. How'd you like that one? What was that? Thanks for come. Well, man, that's gone. Give me more. Okay, we'll give you Ray Sneed and his dance creation. Ow, take it. 